Okay, here's today's quick solve or this week's quick solve whodunit puzzle. All right, so remember, I want you to listen to this. In fact, you may be able to play it over a couple of times until you think you know the answer. So I'm going to read it and then I'll hit pause and then I will reveal the answer. Okay, so for the kids here at school, I'll do that, but for the kids at home, Pause it and see if you can come up, you know, maybe even jot down notes. So it's so important to learn how to listen and pay attention to the details. Okay, this one's called The Doubtable Burglary. David Doubtable was showing Dr. Quicksolve the window that had obviously been jimmied open by the burglar. The glass had not been broken, but the window had been forced open with some sort of pry bar. <clears throat> Let's go outside and see if we can find out anything there, said Quicksolve. Mr. Doubtable led him out the back door and right to the window that had been pried open. Searching the bushes beneath the window, the detective found a large screwdriver, apparently the tool used to pry the window open. Oh, that's mine, said Mr. Doubtable, taking the screwdriver. I'll put it away downstairs. Mr. Doubtable then took Dr. Quicksolve through the house, showing him what had been stolen. Adding up the value of my wife's missing jewelry, the television, stereo, and everything, the value comes to over $50,000. It's a good thing I'm insured. Was anything taken from the basement, Mr. Doubtable? Quicksolve asked. No, I was lucky there. I have a lot of valuable tools down there but there's no evidence the burglar even went downstairs. It looks like he knew what he wanted and went mainly for the expense of jewelry, was his reply. It looks like he, or should I say you, chose the expensive and highly insured items. Am I right, Mr. Doubtable? Why did Dr. Quicksolve suspect Mr. Doubtable was lying? So I want you to hit pause. Okay, and go back and listen to it and figure out if you know why Dr. Quicksolve suspected Mr. Dottable was lying. Okay, here is the answer. Here's the answer. The bur sorry, a burglar couldn't have used Mr. Dottable's screwdriver because it was kept in the basement of the locked house with the other tools. The window had to be jimmied by someone who already had been in the house to get the screwdriver. Therefore, it was Mr. Doubtable. Did you get it correct? All right, uh, thanks and uh, hope you enjoyed this one. Bye.